This is the fill level. Make sure it's right at the fill level, not any higher because once it bubbles, you don't want it overflowing. And that's it on your humidifier. And the same with our drinking water jar, right? Right to the line. On the line, on the line, all our tubes are connected. We're gonna turn the machine on. Okay, so we turn on our machine and we wait about five seconds for this to warm up. And then we look to see, okay, how many minutes do we want? 10 minutes, we hit that button. Then we check our monitor for our weight, right? My weight, I have to do for 125 I'm supposed to be, so it has to go to 25. If I see, oh, it's 25, it's all lit up, I'm good to go. Now, first I'll start with an inhalation, right? People, some people put it at the back of their head and in their nose this way, or you can put it, which I like, in the nose and around the ears. Take my other thing, put it in my water jug, and then this here should be heated up. Now let's say we'll go for 10 minutes. And then you could leave it on, you know, if you uh, press this one power button and hold it, it'll go into a mode where you can go to sleep with it, right? These lights should be on here. If you hold these two, if you don't see the light stay on, Press that down for like five seconds, and then your timer will be on. You know it's your 10 minutes. Here, you can tighten this if you were to sleep with it so it's staying on sturdier, or while you're just working. You could be at your computer, you could be reading a book. And then after I do my inhalation, then I drink the water, because this is when the water is the most potent. So I'll take this off, right? And I take my water. I undo it. Now, I could get a vessel that holds this much. I could drink it from here, but then you'll be washing it. And don't put it in the dishwasher because it'll melt, but you know. So I take uh, something like this, which is the exact amount that would fit in here, right? And I'll take this and I'll fill this up. And I could, you know, drink it throughout the day. Or I could put it in the refrigerator, right? It's good within a 24-hour period to drink that water. It's best right after it. So I'll take it right after I've done a hydration and I drink that water, right? Because um, then you're getting the best benefit from it right after if you're just drinking it. I take this adapter, right? This hose. And this is the one that doesn't have your cannula, right? And you put this on the white. You connect it to the hose, and that you can go as far as you want because it's rubber, it comes off. Say you wanna do a scar or something on your face, right? Just make sure that it's, none of the hydrogen is coming out of it, right? If it's here on your arm, see here if I have it there, it's, the gas is all gonna come out. So you can squeeze it a little and put it right on whatever part you wanna put it on, you know? You take this out, right? I take the one that has the two sides. The long arm. So let's see, I'm gonna do my arm. I take my bag. Now, I put it in my fingers, right? And this is so, when I put this on, I'm not tugging, right? So I take that, put it on. And once it's in there, it doesn't have to be in any place, as long as it's beneath. Now this is kind of, I have teeny hands, but for a man or something, right? So you don't want the, the gas, right? The hydrogen to come out of it, right? So you gotta make sure that's steady. And this is great. You can get these from George. I mean, this is perfect because it has the Velcro and you're putting that around your arm, right? And it's got a little loop here. And then you either tighten it there, you can tighten it all the way up here, right? If you were just doing your hand, you could just do your wrist. So you put that up. And if once you pull it, right, this has Velcro on it, right? And it'll just hold it real nice and snug. And this one is for your leg, huge. Here, I'll show you. And the same thing, right? I'm gonna put it on. Again, you wanna take this and you wanna go all the way down. You don't want it up here because the gas is up here. So you go all the way down and you tighten it to where it's comfortable. Again, you put your Velcro on it, you put it on there, right? 
so if you want to hydrate your eyes, you take your goggles and the same goggles that you did, you know, all your solutions with and that, you know, and it has a little tip here, plastic tip that goes on the hose. So make sure you put that on and then you can put it over and it's like an eye treatment. So your kit comes with a bubbling stone, okay? It's extra. There's a bubbling stone, I don't know if you noticed, on this one, right? That's what gets it going. So, it makes bubbles. So here's the bubbling stone. This one you put in here, in your hose, and then you could put this in a tub and take a bath and you're getting hydration from there. You can take it, you can put it in a foot bath. There goes the yellow light for refill. When you see that, we do what we call topping it off, which means we have to get more water inside our machine. Take our syringe, put it in, fill it up. And then we're gonna put it in our tower. And you see it's dripping a little, so it's good to have that cloth there. Now we're gonna dump this water out and refill it with distilled water. I got my distilled water, fresh distilled water, and I'm gonna put it in the humidifier bottle. And again, I'm looking to go right where that line is. And I take my new water, put this on, go under and just hold it, okay? Put it back in our sleeve. So we're gonna put this back on. Just make sure, always double check, you know, okay, this hose is connected, that hose is connected, this hose is connected. You can always double check because if one hose isn't on, it's not working. Look at your thing, perfect. It's right on full and you're good to go.